In the book of Matthew chapter 11, verse 28 to 30, Matthew chapter 11, verse 28 to 30, the Bible says, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. 29, Take my yoke upon you, and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and you shall find rest unto your soul. 30, For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, Powers, hijacking my prosperity to dreams. Die in the name of Jesus. Powers, hijacking my prosperity to dreams. Die in the name of Jesus. Powers, hijacking my blessing to dreams. Die in the name of Jesus. Powers, hijacking my fruitfulness to dreams. Die in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Today's topic is dream about carrying a coffin. Dream about carrying a coffin or dream about carrying a casket, whichever way you may put it. Carrying a coffin in the dream is considered to be a bad omen. To see yourself carrying a coffin in the dream, this usually symbolizes attack on your finances, attack on your marriage, attack on the glory of your hands, attack on your career, your business, your ministry, your health, your family, or possibly attack of death to come, God forbid. Carrying a coffin in the dream may also represent your concern for someone's predicament and your wish to carry or shoulder his or her responsibilities. The person may just be anybody that you are having that feeling to help or the person may just be anybody that is having that hurt or that desire to carry your burdens or responsibilities. A dream of carrying a coffin on your head spiritually, it denotes spiritual load on your life, spiritual load on your destiny. Someone or the enemy has transferred our problems to your life. The evil diversion was done to destroy it completely. I pray, I command the evil load upon your life to disappear and backfire, to disappear and backfire in Jesus' name. To dream of someone carrying a coffin, then you may need to reject it as well because this is a satanic attempt to make you cry or to make you grieve over someone. God forbid, when you see someone carrying a casket in a dream, it may imply that you are blaming or accusing someone for something you or she didn't do. You need to be very careful of your words and even imagination to someone. When a person carries a casket or coffin in the dream, it means satanic judgment. It means the enemy has concluded the case of that person in the realm of the spirit. So they are just waiting for the physical manifestation or symptoms of those evil judgments against that person. So dreaming about carrying a casket of a known person in the family, this may indicate that you receive bad news, that someone is critically healed in the family, or someone is about to die, or that person is dead. And also be prayerful, because the dream may also be directed to you, that your problem at hand might cause a serious depression to death, to reject it. If you see yourself carrying the coffin of your parent when you or she still alive in the dream, it may be a sign of an impending attack of health problems, death to come in their lives. God forbid. If after carrying the coffin, you drop down the coffin in the dream, this portends freedom and deliverance from satanic attack and oppression of your life and destiny. For others, this dream may not be a bad omen. So to carry a coffin in a dream may also indicate a need to take a big risk in the future. The dream may hold you to face and confront your fears. Do not be afraid to take some necessary risks in life. So in conclusion, dreams of carrying a coffin can be positive and negative for some people. For example, if you wake up feeling troubled in your spirit, then you need to pray for your deliverance because it may appear that you have been caged spiritually and physically. This may also cause you to remain in one spot for life without achieving your success. God forbid. The casket or coffin in that dream represents causes and covenant that needs to be broken so that you can be free from the attack of the enemy. The way out, command the owners of evil load to carry their loads. Paralyze all the walls of darkness in your life. Shake out the evil arrow of loss from your hands. Go for deliverance if this dream persists. Can you read the following Bible verses? Psalm 118 verse 17, Psalm 27, Psalm 18, and lastly, Joshua chapter 23 verse 30. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, I overcome every battle rising against my glory. In the name of Jesus, I overcome every battle rising against my glory. I overcome it by fire. I overcome it by fire. Every battle rising against my glory, I overcome it by fire. 
I overcome it by fire. Every battle rising against my glory in Jesus' name. Say every negative dream that anyone has ever had against my life, I command you to catch fire in the name of Jesus. Every negative dream that anyone has ever had against my life, I command you to catch fire. I command you to catch fire. I command you to catch fire. Every negative dream that anyone has ever had against my life and destiny, I command you to catch fire. Crash land. Die in Jesus' name. Say so you the powers sponsoring evil dreams against my life. Die by fire in the name of Jesus. You the powers sponsoring evil dreams against my life. Die by fire. Die by fire. Die by fire. You the powers sponsoring evil dreams against my life. Die by fire in Jesus' name. Say, by the blood of Jesus and fire of God, I set ablaze every evil load on my glory. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus and the fire of God, I set ablaze every evil load on my glory. I set ablaze every evil load on my glory. I set ablaze every evil load on my glory. In Jesus' name. Say, dreams of affliction expire and die by fire. In the name of Jesus. Dreams of affliction expire and die by fire. In the name of Jesus. Dreams of affliction expire and die by fire. Expire and die by fire. In Jesus' name. So you the spirit of death are rebuke you by the power of God. In the name of Jesus. You the spirit of death are rebuke you by the power of God. You the spirit of death are rebuke you by the power of God. In Jesus' name. So a spiritual cage assigned to attack and steal my glory. Break and scatter. In the name of Jesus. Spiritual cage assigned to attack and steal my glory. Break and scatter. Break and scatter. Break and scatter. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, share to your friends and family. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Lagos. Disclaimer. Evangelist Joshua Ministry does not run an orphanage home. Neither do they solicit for funds on social media. Kindly disregard any attempt by fraudulent pages, asking for money, or favor by sending you private messages. They do not represent the man of God or his ministry. God bless you.